Oh, that's a nice view. Take a hole up ahead. Through it. Yeah. It's a warm day for a change, not even raining, blue skies. Welcome to the spooky woods. Uh, today I'm going to show you a little bushcraft trick which seems to be fairly new on the internet. Um, it's something that might replace rock straps. If you don't know what rock straps are, they're bungees, adjustable bungees with a quick release system, uh, they're very good for uh, motorcyclists, very useful, but uh, not that cheap. Uh, and I saw this trick and I thought that would be perfect and it probably cost less than a penny. So what I need to do is find a piece of hazel or something like that. Well, no saw needed. How can you lose a bike that size? <laughs> First thing we need to do is about an inch from the end we need to drill a hole. I'm using the awl in a Swiss Army knife, but I don't know, small screwdriver, whatever you've got around. So you're probably wondering why the funny hat. I just want to try and make this filming as easy as possible so if it makes me look like a nitwit, I don't care. Please cord tie a loop in the end with an overhand knot. The cord can be power cord, this is braided nylon, you can use bank line, pretty much anything I think as long as it's the right size. And then find out how clean you've made the hole, you need to thread the other end through the toggle that you've made. Oh look at that, just like that that is finished and this is how it works this is so clever I was tell it this is used in uh, Southeast Asia a lot I haven't seen it myself but uh, 
whoever invented it, thank you very much. So take the loop, take the toggle, thread the toggle through the loop, pull on the end. Tighter. Let's go even tighter. How about that? That is not going anywhere. If you want to make it even more secure, you could uh, tie it off around the toggle. When you want to release the hitch, you just turn the toggle around 180 degrees. So you end up with the rope coming, the free end coming out of the toggle is trapped, pinched against the, uh, the other side, which is wrapping around. So I don't know if you can see that. It needs to be that away round. Only one strap on there and that's not going anywhere. So there you go. I think that's a great idea. You can use it for ridge lines on tarps, uh, guy lines. So uh, yeah, there you go. Ready?